There's nothing more exciting for me as a drummer than going and buying a new cymbal. Me too. And just purchasing. This is my good friend, Paul. So I brought in the big guns for this one. This is Paul Francis. He is the head cymbal, Smith cymbal maker, honey. Yeah, yeah, you can master cymbal maker. Master cymbal. I have an official title. Use but those I'm large, just, I'm just, large. You're just the guy that, that I they make have symbols. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. I like it. So he is the guy in charge of the sounds for Zildjian. In this video, we're gonna be talking about five pro tips for buying the perfect symbol. Step number one. Got it. Step number one, you're gonna you're gonna go to the store, you have a symbol that you have in mind that you wanna check out. Okay. You wanna bring your existing symbols with you. Okay, so don't go without the friends. You yep. gotta bring the friends with you so they can. Yep. You want to make sure that they're going to play nice. Okay. Second tip is bring your drumsticks that you play with. Okay. Don't use no. the store drumsticks unless it's, they have the exact same model. Okay. And this is important because tip will vary. We've gotten, yep. Tim and I have gotten into great lengthy discussions about what the tip of a cymbal does or the tip of a stick does to the sound yep. of the cymbal. Absolutely. The and the weight can, of the stick. Yep. Ab absolutely. And so, okay, so we're bringing cymbals with us that you play so that you can see if they nest together yep. and you're you're playing with the actual sticks. So you're trying to recreate that environment as yep. much as you can. Okay, so what's the, what's the third tip? The okay. third tip, uh, bring a friend, drummer friend of yours that you trust. They're yeah. playing so okay. not only can you play the cymbal and they can say, yes, this is what it sounds like. Then you can have them play. And you can listen from afar because you want to hear it up close. And then you want to hear it far away because you're the one that's going to be playing the instrument. Okay. So bring bring a drummer friend or whoever that you you know can can tap on the cymbal for you and you trust. And you can listen. Yep. I like it. Yep. Okay. All right. So what's the fourth one? Um, you want to take the uh, cymbal off the wall if it's on a wall because a, a, a wall, a display wall is going to suck the sound of the cymbal up. So take uh. it off, put it in the middle of, of the store on a stand. Uh, if you can, and play it. Okay. And then you're really going to hear how the symbol um, will behave. Okay. Yeah. So you need to put it on a stand. Yep. Okay. Yep. Awesome. And what's the what's the fifth one? If you can, um, you know, ask if you can use if the if the store has a teaching studios or rehearsal studios. Uh, can I can I bring this one in and play on a drum set with the rest of my symbols? Yeah. Because you want to make sure all the symbols play nicely together. Right. Yeah. yeah. Because so, it's a big investment. It is a big investment. And I, I, I tell people all the time, I tell students all the time, don't be afraid to ask for them to let you do certain things, like play the cymbal. Can I go to this room and play the cymbal? Mm -hmm. Do you have a room that has a little bit more controlled environment than yeah. this wide open sales right, floor? Right. Don't be afraid. You know, I mean, you can't take it home for three weeks. And, you know, but don't be afraid to ask them, hey, can you accommodate me while I hear this? Because it's a big Right. Big purchase. They don't want you to be disappointed. So they, they most drum stores will say absolutely. Right. You right. know, and they, and you don't want to go in and you don't want to bash the symbol that you didn't buy yet. You know, you want to, you, you're just trying it. So, right. absolutely. You know, be respectful until you get to bring it home and then you can play it however you like. Awesome. So you heard it. Five pro tips for buying your perfect symbol. You can go follow Paul uh, over on Instagram at yep. Symbol Craftsman. Yep. Uh, on Instagram, he posts some really cool stuff of whatever he's working on in his in his layer where he builds <laughs> all the sounds that we in the dungeon. Play. In the dungeon. The dungeon. It's Symbol Dungeon. I like it. Uh, so be sure and do that. Give this video a thumbs up if it's helped you. Uh, pass it along to a friend that you think it may help. And leave us leave a, a comment and let me know what your tip is for buying a symbol. Maybe you're like, oh, I when I buy a symbol, I do this and it's mm. had great results. So leave that in the comments. Jump over to the website if you need uh, some lessons. Check out what Paul and Zildjian does over on the website. But whatever you do, I'll see you here in the next video.